So how to maintain the Oka Air Detoxifier? Firstly, uh, every 6 months, 4 to 6 depending how uh, dirty is the environment. So there is this thing called thumb screw. So the thumb screw, you, the meaning you can use your finger to open up the screw. Okay, and you remove the first layer is a pre-filter. You can actually wash it or you can just vacuum it. Now the second layer over here is what we call the washable HEPA filters. It can filter up to 0.3 micron, so you can basically vacuum it. Now the third layer here is a combination of active carbon and also the titanium photocatalytics. So this one, do not wash it, just vacuum it. Right? And the fourth layer over here, this is what we call the photocatalytic titanium oxidation filters. So again, you just need to vacuum it. Now, comes here, you can see the fifth, uh, uh, fifth technology with the UVX or is a combination of UVX and also UVC that is germicidal and over here the sixth technology this is the ozone ceramic plate at this plate what you can do is like you can use a running water use a, a, a used toothbrush just brush it off make sure there's no dust collected over here and uh, make sure it's really dry before you insert it back so when you insert back you see the arrow over here just put it in and push it all the way right? so as for the 7 and 8 technology you can see over here is something like a lollipop uh, this is called the UV antenna ionization so what you can do is you can use a wet tissue just wipe it okay and the inner you see there's a box here that is the uh, plasma ions again you use your wet tissue just wipe it the middle point now the ozone ceramic plate once it's dry just insert back according to the arrow shows over here push it all the way now the second one nearer to the UVX light is the titanium photocatalytic filters is to put it inside the machine okay there's a slot over here make sure it's up uh, uh, before the lever and then we have the titanium the active carbon make sure it's after the lever here this is a safety lever so you will just put it over here one and then followed by the medical grade HEPA filters and the pre-filters so once done you can just screw it back using the thumb screw